focusing on you. Innovations in modern medicine from your team of experts at UHealth, the University of Miami Health System. When Dean Metzler's personality drastically changed from easygoing to short-tempered, his wife of 30 years didn't know what was going on. All of a sudden, he was very angry all the time. Angry to the point of slamming things. It was so not him. I'm usually a happy, fun, joker, kidder, make trouble, but fun. And apparently, slowly, my personality changed to angry, short-fused, an MRI revealed Dean had an orange-sized tumor pressing on his frontal lobe. Dr. Jacques Morcos, director of skull base and cerebrovascular surgery at UHealth, diagnosed Dean with a meningioma. Most meningiomas are benign. Only 1% of them are cancerous. If a tumor, a meningioma is right here, it will affect the left side of the body. If it's on the front of the brain, it will affect personality. If it's on top of the optic nerves, it will affect your vision. Doctor, how do you treat these types of tumors? So those tumors can be very challenging when they reach this size. Surgery requires what's called skull-based techniques. It's an, it's an incision at the top of the head. You want to preserve the brain as much as possible. You do that by removing bone. Dean underwent a 10 and a half hour surgery where Dr. Morcos and his team of specialists were able to remove 100% of his tumor. We are really the team to come to because we have all the talent under one roof. And that is not just neurosurgery. That is ENT, ear, nose and throat, neuroautologist, rhinologist, radiation oncologist. We have the world famous Baskin Palmer Eye Institute with all their neuro-ophthalmologist, oculoplastic surgeons. His wife, Candell, says she finally had her husband back. He's fun loving, he's loving again, and patient and fun, you know, the, the man I knew and married. I'm thankful to still be able to be here and be a part of my family and have, you know, all my marbles where they belong and to get a second chance. The Metzlers say they will never forget Dr. Morcos and the entire U Health team. Every single year I made a plan, I have to just reach out to Dr. Marcos and thank him profusely from the bottom of my heart for me and my family for what he did with my husband and for mm -hmm. getting him through that surgery in one piece and back to us because we're forever grateful yes, to him and the team.